सो हाई डियर स्कॉर्पियो अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल ऑफ रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द स्कॉर्पियो सन मून विनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जर्नल इट माइट और माइट नॉट प्रेजोनेट विद यूर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकेंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स ऑल्सो थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम ट्वेंटी थर्ड टिल द ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ ऑफ अक्टूबर एंड दिस इज वैलिड फॉर एवरी ट्वेल्थ साइन दैट यूर डीलिंग विद अलॉन्ग विद योर ओन साइन सो लेट स्टार्ट योर पर्सन और योर पार्टनर्स कर फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नाउ एट दिस प्रेजेंट मोमेंट लेट्स इज स्कॉर्पियो we have the three of swords someone is deeply in pain here they are so much in pain i can't even tell you like three of swords is the like uh, uh the level of pain that you cannot bear up like uh, beyond this point you will not be able to bear it so this much pain this person is going through right now at this present moment might be because of so many things mix up and uh, it is creating like very painful kind of journey for them let's clear like let's clarify the three of swords here we have the 9 of wands the temperance and the empress see this is someone who feels like giving up on the situation is uh, the right thing to do although they are giving up on the situation like uh, on the surface level they feel like somewhere deep down they still feel like this connection and uh, both of you are kind of still have a uh, still have the potential to become something beautiful in the future you guys still have this uh, mm -hmm. Although they're giving up, they still have this hope that someday might be we are going to start it, initiate it again, and someday might be we guys are going to be together again. They're so much in pain that they're creating scenarios to soothe themselves uh, from the pain, to let go of the pain that they are in right now. They're trying to like uh, get the balance back in their life because this is something that's too painful for them to handle. That is why they are just trying to bring the balance back in their life uh, by. saying things to the themselves that are not even true or that might never be true yeah for some of you this person is uh, like uh, re reminiscing the past and they are feeling like okay they had a good time with you and uh, now it's time to say goodbye even if it is a painful goodbye but uh, they had a good time with you they had good memories with they have good memories with you right let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side scorpio it's a uh, temperance in reverse so you are feeling like okay there's nothing left in the situation and you are in this energy of getting a little bit impatient when it comes to love and relationship let's clarify the temperance in reverse we have the 7 of cups the 8 of pentacles and the 5 of pentacles you have so many things to accomplish in one lifetime in this lifetime you are like what should i do although you are feeling the uh feeling the feeling of loss from inside of you but at the same time you you feel like you should put in the effort and energy in the right direction and this particular connection this particular situation is not the right direction as of now so even if you are feeling like somewhere somewhere deep down you are feeling like uh, having a sense of loss inside of you but still you are working on something that's more important than that although you are feeling lost and confused but you are like okay no no matter what i have to accomplish certain things in my life and i'm going to work on that no matter what okay this is what you are up to right now scorpio from your side and you feel like surrendering to the divine as much as you can and going going with the flow kind of thing let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation between you and them ace of cups they want to come towards you with a open energy with a open heart they are like i want to open up to scorpio no matter how emotional how overwhelming it is going to be i just want to open up i just want to like connect with scorpio again maybe they want a second chance with you let's clarify the ace of cups We have the Ace of Swords, the Emperor, and the Page of Pentacles. They want to clarify each and everything between you and them. Whatever happened, happened. They want to start uh, like from scratch, like literally from scratch, where everything is like uh, the uh, everything of the past is uh, going to remain in the past. That now they want to level up to this energy of I am going to act mature, I am going to behave mature, I am going to make uh, mature and conscious and stable decisions. I want another chance. Scorpio, somebody wants another chance with you. 
a clean fresh start a clean slate and an, uh, and a second chance leaving everything in the uh, uh, everything of the past behind although on the physical level you might be thinking they are completely moving on they don't care about you but they do they are so much in pain and they want a second chance with you they want a friendship kind of energy to start with and this time they are planning not to mess up no matter what let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side scorpio let's see two of cups right now i think you just want to like align with your uh, within yourself with your uh, divine feminine and masculine energy you want to uh, hmm. you want to get in sync with your emotional and practical side and you want to seek the balance within yourself you don't want to be very harsh you don't want to be rude but at the same time you don't want to be too vulnerable or too much sensitive about uh, situations okay let's clarify the two of cups okay so we have the king of pentacles and the ace of wands and the seven of wands see the thing is that you want to like uh, start your life on your own terms you want to be in this uh, stable position in your life now it, it could be financial stability it could be uh, otherwise the like uh, sometimes we feel very hopeless and uh, like uh, imbalanced kind of energy you don't want that kind of energies uh, any more in your life nobody wants that but right now you are very very much in this energy energy of i want to align my energies i want to feel good i want to start with the uh, like new chapter of my life with this positive uh, mindset and i want to keep everything and everyone at a distance that's disturbing my energy in any way shape or form this is what you are up to this is what you want i do see that you wanting a soulmate is uh, also in your mind but right now that is not the main focus hmm very good so you are showing me all the good things but uh, you are very mentally like tired mentally drained you can't stop thinking about something or someone but uh, you are showing me okay anjali it's temporary i know and i am going to focus on the bigger picture so this is what you are wanting let's see what's coming towards it is the 29th of october uh, like scorpio what's happening six of wands okay success is coming victory is coming you are going to be the center of attention of lot of people around you now if you are going to sit on a, on your ass and do nothing it's not going to happen obviously honey you need to move your ass and you need to work on work for this okay so let's clarify the six of wands some people they are yeah, nothing is happening i'm eating popcorn all day i'm watching tv i'm doing my own shit but nothing is happening you have to go out of your comfort zone you have to start meeting with people you have to start connecting with people and you have to literally go out in the world and go out of your comfort zone to make these things happen for you honey this is the moral we have the lovers the three of pentacles the strength card somebody around you is going to be very much attracted to you they want some kind of collaboration or partnership with you but they are going to hold back this urge of connecting with you because either they might think that you already have somebody in your life because you are too attractive and too independent to be single or uh, or they are going to be someone who is already having someone in their life but they are getting too infatuated and too much attracted towards you also that is why even if you are going to feel somebody around you attached to you in that way attracted to you in that way you you will know it properly but either you will be holding back or they will be holding back but i do see a sense of someone coming towards you and very much attracted to you they can't resist this attraction they can't uh, this they can't resist this pull towards you so with actions i do see somebody coming towards you and you feeling their energy to uh, energies but when it comes to feeling they are not going to say anything you are not going to say anything i do see this holding back kind of energy hmm. but there will be a very strong pull and very strong attraction between you guys let's see the guidance for you guys scorpio in the situation we have the queen of swords the death card and the ace of cups hmm mm -mm. you need to cut this kind of kind of energy of uh, thinking about it is also going to end in disaster that is also going to end in disaster everything is is, is a disaster everyone is a disaster <laughs> no scorpio if you are going to think like that you are going to attract these kind of beater and these kind of rude and uh, uh, off kind of energies only towards you please trust me okay you need to open up your heart chakra you need to be ready to hurt yourself again to get to the point where you will be no more in this energy of uh, fearing love and relationships okay so if the the like uh, the main goal of relationships for us in this lifetime is to 
help us grow every every human being on earth is uh, having human experience we are spiritual beings having human experience never forget that so our soul always crave for wanting to be one with the divine wanting to be one with the one we are right now as a human we are separated our souls are like uh, going in different directions so these relationships help us to grow in that way but what we do is we, we become bitter we become closed off we don't trust the universe we don't trust the process and we end up doing uh, feeling isolated and uh, victimized and all this traumatized and all this we need to work on ourselves continuously until we like uh, till our last breath after that the divine is going to help you but just cut the crap of i'm never going to trust anybody i'm never going to love anyone because it hurts let it hurt you honey you are a human and it's very important for you to get hurt time to time so that you can grow yes if you are going to get better there's no point if you are going to get better don't uh, don't uh, take it as waste of your time you're you're getting lessons you're getting better you're becoming one with the divine okay honey yeah so thank you so much for tuning in scorpio i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste